Look, I'm not a young guy. That's no secret. There you go. <laughs> What's going on, party people? What is going on? It's your ride share extraordinaire, your super duper Uber drivers here, guys. Yeah, yeah. You guys, you already know the deal. Before you hop in my ride, do me a favor. Hit the like. Hit that subscribe. Poor favor. Come on, let's do this. Hop on in. Buckle in and let's go. Yeah! Okay, okay, party people, welcome back. And if you're new to my channel, thank you for hitting that subscribe button. All right, Ken, folks, what are we talking about today? Man, oh man, breaking news, breaking news. We had a whole week of the liberals, the Democrats. They were all gloating, high-fiving each other, patting each other on the back, and, you know, walking around, giving Donald Trump the moniker, convicted felon. <laughs> Donald John Trump. Don't tell me. <laughs> is a convicted, convicted felon. They love it. Everywhere you go, the president using it. Kamala Harris keeps using it. Convicted felon Donald Trump. Well, I have some sad news for you guys. The judge, Ron Machern, Ron Merchon, whatever his name is, the, the judge that was overseeing Donald Trump's case, he put out a letter today on a Friday. And it says on the letter that it might have been compromised. The jury might have been compromised. Now, jury number four, his dumbass was talking to his cousin. And his cousin put out a statement on Facebook a day before the trial was ended, the day before the verdict came out. And he blurts out and says that Donald Trump's going to be found guilty. Now, Ron, the judge, had to come out and post it up. I know it was probably tearing him up to do it, too. I know it. And he put out this letter here and says this. Folks, major breaking news on the Trump verdict out of the rotten apple. A New York Supreme Court has just notified, or the New York Supreme Court has just notified Judge Juan Mershon that someone identifying themselves as the cousin of one of the jurors posted to the court's Facebook page that Trump was going to be found guilty. This happened one day before the verdict was announced. We're working to verify all this information and what it means about Trump's case. Oh, man. Oh, man. You almost had him. You got to be quicker than that. <laughs> man, oh, man. See, again. This guy, Trump, got to be the luckiest son of a gun on earth. Every time y'all try to put him in a box, every time y'all try to get him, every time y'all do this, it blows up in your face. Every time. And here's the latest one. So, now, the Democrats are kind of cynical. They're very crafty. So, I don't know. It might be a mistrial, 
or they might retry them again. Another five, six, seven weeks. But I don't think they're going to do that because, again, the American people are exhausted. But New York might try it again. They might try it just to tie them up, just to keep them from campaigning. And they might try this. But if this is a legitimate mistrial, I don't think the American people have an appetite for it. The whole New York state knows about this trial. So, again, he won't get a fair trial. Right? They're going to have to go through the whole jury process all over again. Find somebody who's not biased in New York, in Manhattan. Good luck. And you've been exposed already. It's been exposed. So for you to try this again, eh, I don't know. <laughs> but free my nigga Donald Trump. There you go. I can't wait to see it on Monday. It's Friday. It's a news dump day. Everybody's going for the weekend. But this is the number one trip. Tri this is the number one training thing this weekend. Mistrial. And I love it. I'm here for it. There you go, Donald Trump. You keep on marching along. All right. The Trump train continues. Come on board or get your ass run over. If you guys got any value out of my content, do me a favor. Hit the like. Hit that subscribe. You see that notification bell? Turn on the notification bell so you get my latest and greatest. Share this content with your best friends and tell your mama I said hi. <laughs> All right, all right. So next time, guys, I'll see you again. And all you New York jurors, get your ass off my lawn. <laughs>